Welcome to FX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Now, if there's one thing that netizens have, or even fans, have always praised Davido for, is how he loves his children. Davido will show out and show up for his children, and you can always see the pride that he has as he posts each and every of his children showing up at their birthdays. And so when Davido's first baby mama, Sophia Momodu, took to her Twitter to share some messages, netizens felt that this is a woman who is bitter, who is perhaps wanting Davido back because she hinted or rather put out tweets indicating that people can co-parent in peace. They don't have to be together. The reasons why she put these messages, we don't know. But as the backlash was continuing and Nigerians were calling her out, saying that this is somebody who's very bitter, this is somebody who has not moved on. And before you even get to those tweets, um, this year through her daughter's page, they celebrated or rather wished Davido's other baby mama's daughter a happy birthday. And you could see people commenting, some of them asking, why don't you post Ifani, that is the son to Davido and Chioma who passed away not so long as well it was reported that her and davido unfollowed each other on instagram she was not happy that davido and chioma had rekindled their relationship anyway let's just put that aside let's get to the tweets so she tweets as an african woman it should be okay to prioritize one's self peace relationship with god and personal growth over all else without being trolled by the faceless and insecure she goes ahead also to tweet again it's okay for two people to have a child together not be together however decide to co-parent in peace for a great good without faceless people behind fake pages projecting their insecurities on them and so for some reason fans felt that this was an attack on davido and as we know the loss of davido's son shook everyone and you can stumble upon a lot of posts on social media as to how people were shaken by the loss of this child and so when people saw these tweets they rained on her they said this is a man who is mourning and this is the time that he choose to post this on your social media even forcing her to put out another tweet saying it's okay for a woman to decide to carry on with her life without every single thing she does trickling down to an ex and the hashtag through all these tweets was normalize this and the last tweet basically indicated that she was not insinuating that this is about davido and even putting out that you know whatever i'm putting out there does not have to trickle down to an ex and so with people attacking her some lashing out there are those who definitely fell on the chopping board and i'm just going to read one of the tweets here and the tweet read so sophia momodu blocked my a because i commented on her post that she claimed davido is neglecting his own flesh and blood meaning imade what i said wasn't meant to be harmful though madam get over what it is you are going through and heal and so these were the kind of tweets that people were leaving that this is a woman who has not healed and actually the tweet that got the lady i am loved uh, blocked is this the loving davido i know will never turn his back on his kids unless something fishy is going down and many tweets were in this direction davido would never turn his back on his kids and then prompting his uh, baby mama to put out that everything that is shared or posted on social media does not trickle down to her ex and so as you all know guys about two weeks ago davido was celebrating his birthday or rather it was his birthday he did not celebrate he did not post anything on social media if you have been following the updates that i have been sharing with you guys davido was really looking forward to this birthday davido was turning 30 he had spoken about his big 30 birthday and sadly his son passed away few weeks before his birthday and davido's baby mama first baby mama through their daughter's instagram account posted this photo right, that you see right now here it is a photo of davido with his kids including ifani who passed away and this particular post of wishing davido a happy birthday uh wishing him love and peace and all that was something that netizens did not take kindly there was serious backlash that came with this especially because you know people are not out um um wishing davido a happy birthday because he was in mourning there was nothing to celebrate during this time and so she put out this statement saying i realized that the earlier post may come across as insensitive and 
I sincerely apologize as that was not the intention. Imade deeply loves her father and all her siblings. And as a mother, I'm doing my best to guide her through the difficult emotion of grief from the loss of her brother while trying to celebrate her father's birthday. I ask for your consideration and hope that you all can be understanding during these times. Thank you. And that was signed by Sophia Momodu. And so this was a woman who was not bitter, let's say a few weeks ago, as she took to her daughter's Instagram page to post a photo of their daughter uh, celebrating her dad. And even prior to Davido's birthday, there have been several posts that have been posted on their daughter's page. And there was no indication that Davido is a deadbeat dad. Whether these tweets were directed to Davido, we might not know, but she put out that it has nothing to do with her ex. Anyway, that was what was happening on the other side when it comes to our brothers and sisters in Nigeria. You're up to date. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. Also turn on your notifications so you're notified once new uploads are up. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.